Hello everyone and welcome to our series of tutorials. So in this video we are going to do a very quick overview of loading model and setting up a few materials and download the model. So let's get started. So first of all uh, you are in the viewer tab, select a local file, let's select this one, it's a 3dm file. And then, first of all let's start by selecting the diamond so you can use your mouse and do the left click and select or you can also use the trackpad where you can just tap and uh, it will select the corresponding object. So go to the picking tab now to diamonds, make diamond, give it a cache key that is very important. So in this case we will cover these details later in tutorial but right now just give a cache key round leave all of these by default and as you can say that this is diamond now let's go to the viewer and apply a few presets a preset diamond materials which are available available in the material library so click on the gems and the gem library is loaded at the same time we can load the metal library and this is loaded to apply the materials from the libraries go to the picking material library and drop this and you have to select an object in order to apply that so let's say uh, my ruby material as you can see this is applied citrine and blue and so on now you can select the metallic part and apply a metal material so let's select gold go yellow here so we have the corresponding material applied on this. Now you can go to the viewer and do some more settings quickly. So in the presets, we can change the environment. So as you can see that when I change the environment, the complete look and feel of the scene is changing. So let's choose environment 30. And one of the very important features is that can choose a different environment map for gems. So let's choose in the gem 4 and this is applied only to the gem. So this scene is kind of ready with a very minimal setup. Now what you can do is you can download this model. So this model as you can see is downloaded and uh, I can open a new tab And drag and drop that model and all of the settings which we had applied in the scene are uh, intact, the environments, the colors of the gemstones and the metals. So that way you can very quickly uh, set up a scene, apply your materials and also you can download it for later use. So this is a very quick overview of how do you get started and apply some materials and from now onwards let's go into some more finer details on how to use the editor for producing uh, more advanced results. Till then, thank you so much. See you next time.